for. Sasa inategemea hiyo mbegu yako inaanguka wapi? Naomba ianguke katika mchanga mzuri. Sababu maombi yangu ni kwamba usaksiti ufanikiwe. Amen. Amen. Maombi yangu ni kwamba ufanikiwe. Swali inaweza ikafikia mtu wa Mungu. Why must you, must you have a vision? Why must you have a vision? Why must you have a vision? Ningekuwa na mic ningekupea. Uzungumuze na nguvu kidogo. My brother is saying something here. I'm asking, why must you have a vision? Anasema, what that view? Amen. A vision, but you have a vision for you to succeed. You must have a vision for you to succeed. Amen. Wonderful. Bwana asubuhi sana. Amen. Because if you don't have it, how can you succeed? Amen. 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 And did you know that the Bible says that my people perish because they have vision? Sio. My people perish because they have wonderful vision. Sio kwenzi inasema hivi. Hapana. Inasema aje. My people perish because they lack. My people perish because they lack vision. So when you don't have a vision, you perish. And when you have a vision, you succeed. Now what is your vision? If I may ask. That one don't answer. You know it yourself. <laughs> but as we say, what is your vision? What is your vision? But as we say, we began by saying this. We are speaking about a vision. And we are saying a vision is a clear mental image of a preferable future imparted by God to his chosen servants. And we are saying and it is based upon an accurate understanding of God self and also circumstances. This is a clear mental image that you must have. Kill out. You must have that image which is very clear because that one will direct you on how to go about things. When you are seated here, you must be having a vision in your life. What do you want to achieve in this life? Do you want to live and die poor? Do you want to live and succeed in many things? That one depends on the vision you have. <laughs> because to us Christians, success is guaranteed. Amen. Yes, that is our portion. Because we serve the mighty king, the king of kings, the lord of lords. Buenas we sir. Mfalme wa fami, aliye na nguvu, aliye na uwezo, na utajiri wote huko mikononi mwake. Na sisi ni watoto wake. Kwa nini zuridi? Si mtoto anaridhi mali ya baba yake. Yes. Si ndugu. Si hata kama kuna kashamba kakubwa anapewa. Si ndugu. Kuna kamari kazuri anakadhiwa kidogo. Si ndugu. Sasa Mungu wetu ni tajiri, ako na mali mingi. Kwa nini tutaseka? What your vision is. If you don't have that vision, then you will not get it. God ako katika business ya kupatia watu vitu watu waliyo na makono. One day, he told Abraham, stand up. Akasima. Angalia, akamambia, angalia pande ile mwisho. Keuka, angalia pande ile mwisho. Keuka, angalia, na anamambia, the far your eyes can see, that is what I'm giving you. What are you seeing? I remember when we were little children in primary school, sometimes our teacher used to ask us questions. 
and at Uliza, what do you want to become when you grow up? So, 
Unafika hapo unaangalia. Unasema hata kama ni mna gani iwache hiyo kitu ikae. Ama wewe ndio utafute njia nyingine hata kama ni mbali hata kama itakukost. Uende salama. Bwana asifiwe sana. Taraja sio tu taraja. Bwana asifiwe sana. A vision is an insult. Preach from the present to the future. So you need a preach ambayo itakusongesha that level. And that one because you are here. Ukiwa hapa tutakuonesha haya mafunzo yanafanyika taraja yanakusongesha to the next level. Utafika. Bwana asifiwe sana. Utafika. Ukiwa hapa utafika. Na mmeipata nikisema hivi. Ya kwamba a vision is a future in a seed form. Mmeipata nikiwa hapa. A vision is as a, a future in a seed form. Yani, hii ni maisha yako ya baadai ambayo imewe kwa kwenye beko. Na nikasema, sasa uki wana beko. Uwe mtu mjanja. Uwe mtu mzuri. <coughs> kwa sababu unaweza pewa mbeko ila kusaidia na kuleta manufaa na unaweza pewa mbeko na isikusaidie isilete manufaa yoyote nyumbani kwetu huko wakati mwingine wakati ya njaa hata mbeko ingekuja mkechukua maji muende muoshe hiyo dawa iko kwa mbeko mpige mkono sasa unafikiria hii mbegu naenda kupanda mpaka miezi sita mimi nakufa na jasi nioshe hivi tu nikuni. Unaosha unakuni. So wale walifumilia na ile njaa kidogo wakati wa mafundo na hapo wanaanza kufikiri kukata mahindi wanasimamisha wasema aki. Na nani aliniambia kule mbegu yangu? Nani alikwambia? Si ujue sahihi bwana asifiwe sana. Amen. Na mbegu yenyewe ukienda kuipanda pia iko na characteristics zake. Tena tukiwa wachinga za masili watoto. Tukipanda ile mahindi. Unaweza tukaanza kujiuliza maswali. Na hii mahindi na meanga aje. Maswali ya ujinga. So asubuhi usimepanda jana, asubuhi unaenda una chekwa kidogo uangalie. Uone imetoa hiyo msisi. Kuna ni pata <laughs> unakuta iko kitu yote naenda tena kesho unarudi eh unaenda ile ile ujinga pia unafanya so tunachimbua tena so ile tulikuwa tunachimbua tukitoa nje tatu tunakuja tunatoa sasa tukagundua yale ambayo hatukuwa tunafungua yanaanza kumene na ile tumekuwa tunafungua bado haimei network ujinga ya zamani <laughs> bwana asifiwe sana mbeku hiyo lazima iose mbeku hiyo lazima ife na lazima ife ndio ifanye nini ime bwana asifiwe sana ikiwa mbeku haitakufa haiwezi mea sasa hii tulikuwa tunaenda kuitoa inabaki mzima tunarudisha tena tena kesho tunakuja kuitoa. Wakati naanza kujiandaa kufa ili me sisi hao tumefika mlento. Naweka tena kwa jua. Tunaangalia tunapendua, tunapendua. Hata ikiwezekana tuoshe kidogo na maji, tuangalie tunakuona ile ile mzizi natokaje. Tuliona. Tuliona. Lakini like tuliona zile zingine zimeanza kumea. Leto wana. Mwambie jirani leto wana. Leto wana. Bwana asifiwe sana. Amen. Kwa hivyo future yako iko katika hali ya mbeko. Your future is in a seed form. Amen. So the way you will handle your seed determines the outcome. The way you will handle your seed determines the outcome. 
vile ambavyo utaihandle mbegu yako hiyo ndio sasa itakupatia mazao mazuri bwana asante sana sasa swali ndio lile pale kwa ubao why must you have ambition ndugu yangu alikuwa amepua prayer hapa mzito sana eh why must one have a vision my brother do you recall what you say can you say it again yes for you to succeed in life in other words when you don't have a vision forget about success in the future are you trying to say that yes. wonderful yes. so my brother is saying that for me to succeed in life i must have a vision for you to succeed in life you must have a vision kindly we want all our members to have visions about their future all of us because at the end of the day we need success At the end of the day we need to see you successful person. Hiyo ndio furaha ya mchungaji. Na ndio furaha ya kanisa ambalo linakuwa. From one level to another level. Kwaana sasa. Amen. So make sure you capture one. My right. So kindly don't just sit and wait. There is that vision that God will deposit in your life. But you can pray and ask God to give you what you want in a vision form so that you can begin working on it. Bwana Yesu wesa. Amen. When you go back in the Bible, all those people who have succeeded, they had visions. And God is in a program or in the process of working with people with visions. Amen. Not people who are just sitting doing nothing. Wait. You get the way? God is ready. Na anafanya kazi na watu ambao wako na maono wanaendelea. Kwa hivyo, you need to rise up and begin working on something. Ili future yako iwe nzuri. So you ask yourself a question what are you doing right now That one you don't answer because you know it by yourself Bwana Swesa Amen Why must you have a vision Number one, the Bible says that where there is no vision the people Hiyo <laughs> sasa pastor hiyo ni Biblia Sibirio Proverbs 29:18. Sibirio. Where there is no vision the people perish. Kwa hivyo kama hauna maono, mwambie jirani kama hauna maono. Ndugu yako anatufurahi sana sema wewe kuisha. Kama hauna maono wewe ndipoesa <laughs> Pinga inaweza pika ukali. Pinga pinga inaweza chukua jembe kaenda jambo karibu. Mwambie kwa picha. Kwa na maono. Bwana siweza. Because you want to succeed. Amen. Amen. You want to move to the next level. Amen. You need a vision. Bwana yes. siweza. Don't just sit and wait. You need a vision. Because success iko mikono ni mwako. Bwana asubuhi sana. Amen. Success ipo mikono ni mwako. Ipo moyo ni mwako. Na Mungu ashaweka ndani mwako kitu. Sasa wewe anza kufuatilia. Where there is no vision, the people perish. 
In other words, where there is vision, people succeed. Amen? Amen. Amen. For example, you have. We have a vision of our church. Having a vision of, of our church, haikunyimi nafasi ya kuwa na vision ya familia yako. Narudia. Kukua na maono ya church, ni yewe na pendeza mungu. Lakini, haikunyimi nafasi ya kuwa na vision yako wewe mwenyewe as an individual. You as an individual, you need also to have your own vision. Iyo ita kusaidia kusongesha katika nebo nyingine. Karibu tzada watu mungu. Great people, wonderful, thank you. We are saying, you must have a vision for the place where God has placed you. For the community in which God has placed you, and for the group of the people whom God has placed you under your leadership, or else they perish. Aya, what has we said? Aya, a good song of the Missouri. To some of the Missouri. Number one, you must have a vision for the place where God has placed you to smile out. Bwana siweza. Amen. Mahali pale Mungu amekuweka lazima uwe na maono. Katika ile ndoa Mungu amekupatia lazima uwe na maono. Ile kamuni ambayo unafanya na Kanisani hapa mahali Mungu amekuweka lazima uwe na nini? Maono. Amen. Usipo kuwa na maono familia yako inaangamia. Sipo kwa na maono, hata ile kambuni lienda kufanya nayo kasi, utairudisha chini hata wewe watakufuta kasi. <laughs> Unajaka? That's a fact. Where does it matter? It is a fact. Because, you know, even nowadays, hata wajiri, wanataka watu abao, wanaweza kuwasongesha to the new level. No people, you are not getting what I'm saying. Allow me to repeat this. Where does it matter? Mwajiri today, anataka mtu ambaye atasongesha kambuni yake kiwango kingine. Bwana siwe sana. They want a people who can make a difference. Bwana siwe sana. And how can you show up that you are the right person who can make a difference? You can only show up this when you have a vision. Bwana siwe sana. Of changing things around. Amen. Of working out things in a different way. Unajua, mahali tumefika. Si tu lazima ufanye vitu vile tu vile watu wanafanya. Na ndio maana niliwauliza hapa swali siku moja. Na muniruhusu tena niulize swali kwa vile imekuja tena. Niulize. Unajua Uwana watu ambao tunawasoma katika Biblia ni watu ambao wamefanya maajabu. Akina Elia, Akina Elisha. Wamefanya maajabu. Watu kama Kidion, Daudi, eh, Solomon. Bwana siwe sana. Kuna msiana kama Ruth. Wamefanya maajabu. Matendo ya mitume kuna msiana anaitwa Tabitha, eh, Dorcas. Wamefanya maajabu. Today we are learning about the Bible. Am I right? And that is very good because these are wonderful people. People who have visions. We are learning about them. So today, kama bibiria ingia ingerubiliwa kuandika. Weo wangeandika juu ya kifkani. Wangea jirani haya. Leo hii wangeandika, Josephine. Tungesoma ukuraza ubi na ungesema nini? Ukurusi. Unesema nini kijana? Eh? Mupira? Eh? Chelsea? Na hile ingine na hito aje? Manchester, Man City. Kila takika wako kwa simu wanafuatilia hizo vitu. Mbaka dada sinaisha okoa wanaokoa kapisa mbaka safari kwa mwaiwa peyte. Wako kwa Chelsea. 
<laughs> Unaona? Na ni wachezaji hodari sana wakicheza pale kwa simu, eh? Akia Mungu, mimi ningekuwa huyu ningekuwa hapo kwa ile uwanja. Na hata angekuwa kwa ile uwanja angefanya zero hapo. <laughs> Lakini na mdomo anajua sana kupiga na kufunga pao akakia Mungu nimefika pale Bwana siwe sana Amen Have a vision Change your family Bwana siwe sana Amen Change mahali unafanya kazi Change hata mahali unaabudu Bwana siwe sana Siku moja wakuja ukuta umefanya maajabu mpaka unajiuliza ni udi this Na wewe ulifanya ukaenda zako atotaki kujulikana. Bwana asifiwe sana. Hii yeah, huko na baraka ya Mungu. Sana. Bwana asifiwe sana. What? So when you have ambition it changes things. Na unaona hata kwa kambuni wale watu ambao wana maono hufanya kambuni zina blow. Lakini wao uko tu hapo tu. Unangoja tu kwa manufaa hii ndio wewe ufanye. Usipambiwa faida hii umeenda tuti lakini uko tu hapo uko kwa sababu tuko tu jets. Waje hizo watafuta kazi wewe. Bwana <laughs> Faida tofauti. Mpaka hata mwajiri akikuja si alikupa ufike hapa na umefika huko. Sema eh hey, na wewe mtu na muna gani? Ni mtu wa maono. Bwana asifiwe sana. Wanapenda watu wana muna hiyo. Bwana asifiwe sana. Mungu ana maono. Mungu anataka kukuendelesha lakini uwe na maono. Haya, tumesoma la hili ya kwanza nasema you must have a vision for the place where God has placed you. Umeanza to develop. Haya, number two, for the community in which God has placed you. Jamii ambayo Mungu amekuweka hapo hajakuweka hapo kwa makosa. Mahali ulizaliwa haukuzaliwa hapo by accident. Mungu alitaka uzaliwe hapo. Mbona hukuzaliwa Amerika? My sister aliniambia siku moja jambo. Mzee wako alikuwa anamsumbua sana. Kutoka huko amepitia kule kwingine. Naelewa. Eh ameonja kiasi. Sasa anakuja analipua ngumi kidogo. Analipua kidogo. So my sister akasema, I wish Mungu angeniumba mwanaume. <laughs> Kuna ni pata. I wish Mungu angeniumba mwanaume. Hauna habari hata wanaume wanasema I wish Mungu angeniumba mwanaume. Haya, mwambie jirani haya. Bila Mungu amekuumba na sababu make a difference ukiwa hapo. Bwana asifiwe sana. Amen. There are some wishes that can never happen. So ukiwisha kwamba ningekuwa mwanaume does that mean utakuja kwa mwanaume? Mwambie jirani ndio yapo hapo. <laughs> because kuna ndoto zingine hazinanga faida kama hiyo ina waste your time because you know it cannot change Bwana asifiwe sana Amen Wewe umeona pastor ameombea mtu atawa mwanamke ambaye ni mwanaume And can you begin praying for such a thing Do you want to change the Bible Forget about such a miracle it can never happen. Bwana asifiwe sana. Amen. And the group of people whom God has placed under your leadership. And now this one comes straight to us who are leaders especially in this place. And the upcoming leaders that are coming tomorrow. Bwana asifiwe sana. Si mnajua mwaka inaisha tushaanza ku assess tunapanga line up. Tutaweka wewe kwa nafasi tutafanya kazi nzuri. Bwana asifiwe sana. Amen. Na wala wafanye nzuri sana tutafanya nini tutawambia tulia kwanza kidogo tutapatia maziwa na chapati kule kule kidogo alafu kisonga songa tutapatia tena kazi nyingine si tunafanya hivyo tufanye hivyo kwa ubaya tunafanya hivyo kwa sababu wangu so tukikupea nafasi we want you to have a vision so that you can help us grow si mungu lazima kwa bwana asifiwe sana so ile group ambayo Mungu amekupatia ukaiongoze be it Sunday school have a vision with that Sunday school ikiwa department ya men's have a vision with that department na kuongeza sana department ya ladies hapa ni very good eh very good tunakulanga mandazi nzuri sana this is wonderful 
Bala's <laughs> wesa. That department is so good. I'm not gonna But next year, after six months, to our show. It's no way. To go again. Six to about to go to bus. Kila Sunday. Bala's wesa. Go again. To our show. Eh? To our show. Go again, moon. But I got this here. I'm going to challenge Sun. Na tumeangalia pia tumechipika isabu tumejizoma. So tumeanza kufanya secret meetings. Tutakuja. Hapa na muna gani? Si tutakuja? Na tutawalika vile wawo na tuwalika na sisi. Wonderful. Ba kofi basuri. So you must have a vision for the place where God has placed you. For the community in which God has placed you. And for the group. Uh, of people whom God has placed under your leadership, or else those groups perish. So when they perish, it, we don't blame the groups, we blame the leader who was there. Amen. We don't blame the groups, we blame the leaders. One day when I was in primary school, where to call it? It happened to Yabamba, Joe Sashule, Zikaja. Sasa Joe Sashule, Zikipo Ja, Unajua Sasa, eh, Wanafusi Mari Makwenda Kuna. Nashule in Aendelea. So, Masasi Wakapeleka report Kwa Minister of Health, Wakuja Kushika at Master. Unajua Joe and Semani, at Master, and Jasa Joe. <laughs> It must have been a nini? I may just a job. So it must have been a good idea because my mother The message is you. The message is a job. Here is the job you have. What does this mean to us? <laughs> when you are a leader somewhere, Musonga Bele is meeting the Zen of Atwa Mungu. Eh, Kujeni Apa. Musiyoko Peke Kuka Apa Bele. Yeji Mwabili Mwaka Apa Bele. Eh, wonderful. Asante sana. Kujeni mbele. Eh, kujeni tukai kumbele tu mbele pamoja. Wonderful. Eh, wonderful. Asante sana, asante sana, asante sana. Eh, kaika hapa mbele. Tuna upili jili pamoja. Bwana siwe sana. Eh, Master amejasa? Sure. Ilikuwa ni ukwe? Ilikuwa ni ukwe? And the minister of health was going to reach a full casual. Because the power of the master is just a job. When we open the hoop, yeah, 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 the ghost is there. Zirija, I kill our baby. So I start talking to my man, Mejaza. The hoop, the power of the master is just a job. I kill our baby. So when your department is failing, we kill our baby because we will have to become a macho. What has we said? Amen. We may not do anything. What has we said? Amen. Amen. What if in life the wife says this is the person and the man says this is the person? Your family right now. What has we said? Amen. What if even in the government the president says, ah, these are the ministers I wanted. And the minister stands up and says, this is our president. Your engine ain't happy. But you know what? Many of us are hypocrites. We speak things because there's no otherwise. When you don't speak like that, you'll be fired. So you just stand up and begin praising things about what you want. You ain't your mama in the police. no way. <laughs> because when you don't do, you don't do that, you will be fired, isn't it? So as you must make up on praise, you praise like you look your dog up and you hear that you are going to be a man. So that's how we find it. We are not going to be that way. One as we say, let's do the right thing at the right time to the barikiwa. Okay, now look at this. This is to say, when you are serving under another leadership or administration, you must capture the big vision of the organization 
and then develop your own smaller vision within the big vision so that you can be effective in your particular area of assignment. That is wisdom. I repeat, if you are serving under another leadership, another administration, you must capture the big vision of the organization. That is number one. You must walk with the vision of the company that you are working with. Once you capture that vision in the right way, then you develop your own small vision within the big vision. Here in Akuja, Ikusaidie, so that you can become effective. Katika hiyo na fasi na wana sweza. So, ile kitu inatuangusha, ni ile hali ya kukataa kuwa creative. Wana sweza. Ile kitu inatumaliza, ni ile hali ya kukataa kuwa creative. Wabie mweza kwa begin to be creative na. Anza kuumba vitu. Anza kufanya kasi. Anza kuwaza na kupanga what you can do. Na mungu anangoja tu hiyo uwanzi. Ukianza? Yeah, na kusongeja nada le. Lakinu kiwa omeka, miaka inoenda tu omeka. Mungu andaka uwanze kitu. Bwana sikuwe sana. Anza kitu. Mungu anataka uwanze. Anza kitu. Develop a vision and begin working on it. Begin working on it. Anza. Unajua hata wale watu ambao wako na masupa markets today. Hmm? Wale watu ambao wako na masupa markets na magari mingi mingi. Uona fikiri wanzaliwa wakiwa na? Wali take our positions. Na wakaanza kufuata hiyo. Tulikawa tunaishi embakasi miaka ya nyuma na yeye. When we were serving under another ministry. So the landlord about the boy Naka and I was a very good friend to me. So the boss was a very good friend of me. So it's come over here to 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 enter to capand and do your own fire. So we come here to come over here. You make a man who is so full of joy, full of joy, come on, to come here. Uko, I got to man a sword. I got to nagu. So I'm going to pay that money to get Jana. And as I want to meet the boss. Bana sikuwe sana Anasema kila nangu wate ni kwambie si Usione Tumefika hapa kwa uraisi hivyo Tulikuwa tunakula Ukari na chufi Mwemenzikia kwe Anasema kila nangu Tumefika hapa today kwa sababu tulikuwa tunakula ukali na chuvi. Weo naeza kula ukali na chuvi. Nuki hapa nasema, kama boga imeisha, we don't have otherwise. Sasa yu chuvi kuje. We will eat. Lakini kama boga imeisha. So mimi ni kacharibu kumuelewa kwa mbae. So hindi ka mwambia, so kulikuwa na problem. Unajua sometimes when you want to understand something in a better way, you become like a foolish person. Are you understanding? But when you become clever, unajonesha, you are wise. There are things you don't know in this world. So when you want to know some things, you become a foolish person. When we were in driving school, Walimu walikuwa natuambia hivi, ukitoka, ukienda, uko inje, ukipatana na mreba mwingine ambaye naeza kukusaidia, usi muambie unajua. Umambie, nisaidie kwa tu nijue kwa tu mimi ni kumbafu. Lakini ukumambie najua hata kupea. Na wesu kukusaidia. Su unajua, sasa kusaidia na nini? Su utafute karia. Uno, so unajibanya kumbafu. Nasema, hey, wana, it's me and the shake or tumba kapo to, hey, hey. Sasa ato yo staring, unajibanya kwanza mchinga mchinga, ashike shike kwa kwanza. Unajua, ana feel so good, akiona nataka kukufundishi. Kumbia kirani yetu waka. 
Sasa wewe unachifanya kutuachi nani atakupea? Hakuna. Bwana asifiwe sana. Kuwa mjanja. Uelewe, usonge hatua. Sasa mimi nikamuuliza. Kwa hivyo sasa mbona mlikuwa mnakula na chufu? Kwani mboga ilikuwa wakati ule? So mboga ile ilikuwa ipanga chufu. Sasa kijana elewa akasema bas waja point kuja sasa. So naona nimelipua. Sasa point ifanye nini? Ikuje karibu. Chifanya kumpafu ya zamani kabisa. <laughs> Sema tusemi hivyo. Si kwamba mboga asikuwa. Si kwamba nyama haikuwa. Si kwamba pesa haikuwa. Hiyo viti yote ilikuwa. Lakini ningekula nyama wakati ule nyumba hii ningeijenga aje. Ningekula nyama wakati ule simiti ningetoa wapi? Mwambie jirani endelea kula nyama. Hakuna shida. Bana siwe sana. Hakuna shida. But when you have a vision. Bana siwe sana. But when you have a vi a vision sometimes. Kukula nyama is not a problem. Yeah. It at the middle of the evening and the hour of the time sun. There's no problem. But you must have a plan and a vision. Because if your vision is just eating meat, all right, you will remain with the meat. Wakati wengine wana progress wanaenda, where hakuna? Imeisha. So, anasema nike kula nyama wakati ule. Sasa naniambia, so naona sahi sasa naweza kula nyama. Kwa sababu ye kijana yanku na nipea pesa, nineenda na nua nyama na kula sasa. Lakini wakati ule singe kula, manake nilikuwa na vision ya kujenga hii. Na nikajua nikisha chenda mtu wa inge nyama nitakula. Sasa hiyo nilikuwa nayo wakati ule ilikuwa mbeku. Sasa ninge chukua mbeku ni kule nayo nyama. Ninge kuwa wapi sasa hili. Mambia jirani waja kula mbeku. Kula ukari na chufu. Hauta kola. Kwa ya nasuwe sana. A vision gives you the inner driving force to serve and to achieve. A vision gives you the inner driving force to serve and to achieve. Ukiwa na maono ina kudrive, ina kupeleka. Ukiwa na maono, ina kupeleka. When we came from Ushago, tulikuja na Robi, tulikuwa na tabia ya Ushago. But it changed by force by fire. One of tabia ya Ushago, watu wanakula saa kumi na moja, saa kumi na mbii, saa moja wamelala. So since Nairobi saa moja tumefunga bilango tunalala. So tunajanga also with this people. Shako watu wanamuka saa mbili hata saa tatu. Sababu hakuna kazi ya kufanya. So watu wameamuka wameenda vyo kujiji mbelala. Mnafungua bilango saa mbili saa tatu. And the people are watching and they wonder also. Unajukua kikombo na nawa maje saa tatu. Na nawa usu. And the people are watching and they wonder also saa tatu. Sababu pia huko na maono mati Kuna huko Sio ni maono pia kwa nae Wada sube sana Pia ni maono wenda wa tuzo sata No problem Ala huko nataa kujinangani ya tekesho Atakuwa na gari ya wa kutoka wapi Atakuwa na plot Kujenga inakuwa ipeka kwa wapi Naona na huzo sata Watu wana huko mapi Wana sube sana Kufanya jambo kidogo to make sure they are getting something. Why does we say? Amen. Many people say, I don't have something to do. I don't have something to do. Do you have something to do? Do you have something to do? Ebu mkuse kwanza kidogo asiki. Muulize wewe jirani, do you have something to do? Alafu mwambie hivi polepole na ujunga asikujape kofi. Mwambie polepole, mwambie jirani. If you don't have something to do. 
kindly. Don't do it here. Watch. A vision gives you an inner driving force to serve and to achieve. The vision in a kuamusha sa kumi usingi zimeisha. Sing nothing. Akuna shida do kila lampaka sanani. Manako na muko nenda wapi. Munaenda kufanya ni. Si akuna maono. Si wewe la. Leadership also means working with a plan. Plan your work and the work plan and how you can have a work plan. How can you have a work plan without a vision? Hold on, sis. Why go? In the kitu abao ime to fail sana sis. In the kitu abao ime to angusha sana sis. Kwa sababu hatuna maoni. Tunatembea tukiwa blank. Mami jirani, I want to be different. I'm capturing my vision. Wait me and see me tomorrow. Unashanga. Napenda tabini ni kushanga ikesho. Nitajua mafunzo yangu ilifanya kasi. Na kama sita shanga, mafunzo yangu ilibaki kwa baraba. Na mimi sitaki kufanya kasi ya sana. Mwambie jirani pastor ataki kufanya kasi ya sana. Mwambie jirani kamata maono yako. Tufike mbali. Sasa, nataka kubaliza na hit point. Moja. Because muda wangu inisha. Hii somo ya vision, minaiendeleza next week, mbaka hii week hindi sinakuja. Na hiko kwa ibada ya kwanza, ibada hile naanza sambili, hata hindi meipa maza ya ibada ya pili. Unawana? Inafaa iishe saa tatu. So, ni vile mfuwa hili tuzuia na matope, tukafika tunichelewa. But next Sunday, nitaanza hii chapter saa mbili, saa tatu, nilemalisa. Kwa hivyo, wuhu kuja saa hini, hakuna shi. Mwambia chiranu kuja saa hini, utaipata. Tuko pamoja. Tuko pamoja. Sasa angalia hile chapo hiko kwa mbao. This is wonderful. On the other hand, it is not acceptable, and in fact, a very wicked thing to have a vision that runs parallel to the vision under which you are serving. Tio tu ndio makosa ma watu wanafai. Kuna wana? Na hukitaka kufutu wa kazi, those who are kasikie, umeanza hiyo. Kuna wana? Those who are kasikie, umevanya nini? Umeanza hiyo. Kumoja hili nipata kwa hiyo njia pia. Nilikuwa nafundisha kwa kone chumoja. Bwana asikwe sana. Nilikuwa nafundisha kwa kone chumoja. The college was running very good. But nikijaribu kuambia mdozo wangu, can we introduce this ataki? Can we introduce this? Ita saidia ataki. Ataki kapsa hako mgumu. So one day, I did something. Because I had a vision ya kuanzisha my own company in the future. Because I was operating in another company. Una nipata nisho? So, kile nilifanya, nikaanza kutengeneza mitapu. Exercise books. Unawana? But kile nilifanya, iso exercise book, si kweka jina ya the institution we were working with. Nikaweka the name ya ile vision nilikuwa nae. Ya wanafuzi wakapenda iso mtapu. Ya kaona. Haka angalia. Haka nita. Tuko na kambuni gabi hapa. Tuko na kambuni gabi hapa. Sema. Ngezema ni. Sasa, unaweza kujichawi wakati unaanza maono yako ndani ya maono ingine. Sisemi usianzishe, but hapo nyuma tumesema ya kwamba, ukianza, unaanza something that supports 
what is going on. But ukianza ingine ambayo inaenda parallel. Ndosi ya naoko. Watu wengi upoteza kasi kwa njia hii. Unawana? Lazima uwe mjanja. Ukiwa na your own vision, unakuwa mjanja? Mjanja. Iyo unairani chini ya maji huko. Usirani hapa yuonekani. Wata kufuta kasi. Unaelewa? Unaelewa? Lakini na musingi tuko tunasema hivi. Mpendwa. Wakati imefika, you need to have a vision. Na nimesema, tukifika mwisho wa mwaka, hii ndiyo somo huwa nafundisha peke yake. That is why ni meyanza mapema kwa sababu ni refu. Nisongeshe pole pole, hata ikienda mbaka Christmas Day, suta kwa mekapcha maoni. Sasa hii, ikiwa unataka kukapcha hii na uende mbali, sasa jaribu ufike mapema na usikosi. Manako kikosa, wala ambawa mekosa today, hile ni mefundisha wamepata. So wawo ataendelea tu kula nyama. Alafu atajeka kuroba sinukwe. 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 Lakini sisi tumerefuka. Tutakula chumbi kidogo. To save kwa hivyo ya kasimiti. Tuko pamoja? That is not foolishness. Are we together? Are we together? My wife wanajua some of my characters. Wanajua. Nisa fungua accounts kada na bank. So kuna account moja ambayo nilifungua ambayo kutusaidia kuwaka oti vitu tunataka ata kufanya kununua instruments na kada. Iyo account ni mzuri sana. Manake ukisha ongea na bank ukasema nataka kusafe mbaka 1 million ama a half a million di onitoy inakuwa hivu. Muda jua iyo account? Inaituwa ngaji? Iyo sasa. Fixed account. Iyo account vile umeagree na bank Ya kwamba lazima nifikishe 500,000 Diyo ni toe nifanya what I want Na iyo ni mzuri kwa sababu sila kuanga na riba Sababu unajua huko inafanya kasi So inazalisha kariba kino ukienda kuchukua Lakini iyo account Ata ukawa unakufu Uwewe mwenyewe Uwezi zema pesa yangu kwa hapo nenda kuzutuko Uuda pewa Nani zako and you are dying wisdom utaka kufa kufa tu lakini yu ibaka wapi mbaka utimise vile ulisemu and this sasa basu wende ukope maani ukuja weke hapo paa if you get that level sasa utachukua so hiyo when I want to do something great uwanga na weka hapo sasa tunaweza ata tukalala nja tunaweza ata tukakosa pesa kapsa na pesa hiko na pesa kikuwa. Mbaka hivike kiwango tunataka, ndiyo tufanya kitu tunataka. So when you want to succeed, sinu mekupea kitu. Lakini wana weka tu kwa mpesa. Ati nime safe kwa mpesa. Kwa mpesa una safe kwe. Una safe kwe. Ikifika jioni wanja kwanza ntoe, ni mweko crazy to kwanza. Mgeni ya mengia, hey, 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 kimbia kwa duga, kimbia kwa duga, hey, leka kukwanza wa kwa tefa. Sinu yo, na wanaendelea kwa safe. Sinu kwe. Waja hizo Mwambia jirani ya iweza gani Inuwa kiwango Because unajua Maisha tunaisi saisi Na miaka tukonayo saisi Haita rudi nyuma Na usifikiri ya pamba unaendelea kwa mdogo Tutaanza kufanya kesho Apana Uwe unaendelea kwenda mbele Siku moja ikipita pap Unaseeka kidogo kuliko jana sasa o kingoja ati nitakuja tu wakati inakuja, itakuja siku gani? This is the time! Wana sikuwe sana! So if it means saving begin now! Because you are already late! Sa isu ngeko mefika lemo! Umeni pata vizuri? Umeni pata vizuri? Ungeko mefika lemo? Mambie jirani? Jirani? Nikile siku juwa? Lakini nimejua? Ndakula chumfi? Nataka tusimani. Iyo ndiyo somo.